What's up, YouTube? Cold Ass Ice Prince is coming at you from Minnesota. And today I wanted to share with y'all some turbans I received. Um, actually, I didn't receive them. I bought them from AliExpress. Um, it's like a, it's called the Nigerian Turban. And it, I got it from a company on AliExpress. The name of the company is G Top Fashion. And so I have three different types of head scarves that I'm going to show you guys. And, um, so, the first one is called Luxury Magic Turban. And you can wear it in a lot of different ways. So, this is what the first one looks like. And it comes with a little brooch also that you can put on. I should have opened this already. So... It's, I ordered this one, it's like a, I think it's blue, blue, like a bluish kind of color or greenish kind of color. And as you can see, it's really long. It's like really long. And so it has a part where there's um, this kind of like a V or I don't know what you call this, but right here, that's how you'll know which side is the front or which side is the back by this little thing. So I'm going to go ahead and put it on. I put on my little, um, something I got from my son that I put under my, my wigs and things. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on and wrap it up and show y'all what it looks like. So bear with me. And this one, I wouldn't even suggest wearing it in the summertime because it is pretty hot. Pretty hot. I'm going out tonight to um, Diana Ross concert. And I was thinking, oh, can I wear it? You know, and it's like, no, it's too hot. This is definitely something for the fall or the winter. And I hope I don't start sweating like a... Sweating like I don't know what, just by putting it on. So, just go ahead and, like, put it on, you know, how you like it to go. And then you just start wrapping it around just grab it and kind of pull a little bit but don't go too tight and just keep going around it's so soft this material it's really soft and just keep going around And just keep keep going around until you get it all the way you know and then you just sort of tuck it tuck it and play with it tuck it and play with it and get get it sort of you know to your liking or how you like it to be And I'm not going to spend too much time on this, but I just want to show y'all. Because girlfriend got things to do and places to go and people to see, if you know what I mean. Ooh. So, I think instead of tucking it, I'm supposed to use the pin. Well, just bear with me. I'm trying to figure this out, y'all, with y'all on camera. <laughs> yeah, I should have tried it beforehand, huh? Let me see. Let me see what I'm going to do. I think I am going to tuck it. So this is the front piece where that band was, and then I was I sort of scooted it, sort of scooted it up. And keep talking. Talk better than me, because I'm not taking too much time to do this. So but you know, just keep keep playing with it until you get it as tight or as loose or however you want it and then you just take your brooch and put that on where wherever you like it to be and I'm not 
sitting here trying to figure out which side is best and all that. And I'm just trying to show y'all how cute it is. So push it back if you like it back. Put your little earrings on and you're good to go. <laughs> Isn't that cool? I'm not happy with this top piece, but I'll get it together. Like, if I was seriously about to wear this out, you know, I would actually take time to figure out exactly how to do it. But I just want to show y'all for showing sake. So, there you go. Probably push it back more and put your little baby hairs out. Hey. <laughs> okay, so that's the first one let me take this off and it's pretty snug it's it fits it fits good it's it's snug um it's not too tight you know if you wear glasses like i do um you could you know do it to your liking so that it won't be too tight or whatever Whew. oh girl almost bust a sweat trying to put that on and I'm going to just do this one here since I just picked this one up. It fell. This is just a little, just a little something I saw on their website. A little headband. And I was thinking, you know, put your hair up in a poof in the top. And then put this on. And um, going about your business. I was kind of confused as to which way it go. But I'm thinking it goes like this. So, let me put this on so y'all can see. So this is like a little, just a little cute little headband. And just like sort of put it to the side. See, just a cute little headband. Just with, you know, a little something extra on it. I don't know if you, you, could, you want it all the way to the side or I guess you can do it, you know, sort of push back more or brought to the front more you know just whatever you might be into okay so that that's that one and then also I got this sort of um sort of like a mustard color and it has uh, cute little cute little beads sewn into it and it's um I don't know, maybe five feet in length. And you will have to cut off the tag or, you know, cut this little stuff off too. <clears throat> I didn't like the way that was hanging. I actually wore this one to the mall yesterday. So, and I didn't have this on. I just had my hair back in like a little ponytail. So, let's go ahead and put this one on so you guys can see. And this is the same process with the little V. The V um, in the... I don't know why I keep calling this V, but whatever it is here in the front, that that thing, to know to let you know, sort of guide you to put which way to put it on. So just go ahead and slide it over, slide it on, and then just I like to take this one like down, sort of in the back like straight down in the back so some of the beads can actually show in this area and then I just start wrapping I definitely don't want to get this red lipstick on it either I'm just wrapping and wrapping and wrapping and wrapping until you get to the end. And I really like the I really like um, wearing this one. The only thing I didn't like is like sometimes the like how you just see me pushing that top piece. You sort of have to stop and look in the mirror throughout the day to make sure it's you know how you want it to be. You know what? I went to this seminar, this women's empowerment seminar. And they, they told us that women should spend at least 15 minutes a day in the mirror. 
you know, just like sitting there, I guess, doing like I'm going to do my nails in a minute. I, and I'm a type of person, I never used to do my nails, but like I've started to sort of do them, you know, because they look like I've been digging, digging in dirt, which I have. Anyway, but they were like, yeah, a woman should spend at least 15 minutes a day in the mirror. And I was like, wow, I did not know that. Because honestly, some days, I don't even, I just get up and go some days and I don't even look in the mirror. I mean, I look in the mirror in the bathroom, like brushing your teeth, washing your face type thing. But to actually like sit down at my, my table or whatever and take time and, you know, look at myself or pluck my eyeballs or do whatever, I don't do it. But I'm going to start. Because it feels good. It feels good. So anyway, so this is the, this is the third one. And this is like, um. I guess you could say mustard color or some kind of yellow color and so I hope you can see the detail of the beads I think it's really pretty and it's nice you know I can still plop my glasses on take them off it's not too tight it's not too loose it's not going nowhere um, and it just feels good and it looks elegant yes it looks elegant put your pretty little earrings on and away you go so that's my video for day today, YouTube. As always, thank you so much for watching me. I got to get dressed because I'm seeing Diana Ross tonight. Hey, I love Diana Ross. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, thank you, Jesus. As always, thank you for watching my videos. Grace and peace from Minnesota. Mm -hmm.